A car radiator and a condenser both play crucial roles in your vehicle's cooling systems, but they have distinct functions and work in different systems. Radiator The radiator is a part of your car's engine cooling system. Its main job is to eliminate the excess heat produced by the engine. Here's how it works. Coolant It uses a liquid coolant that absorbs heat from the engine. Heat exchange This hot coolant then passes through the radiator, where it's cooled down by air flowing from outside. Cooling fans Sometimes cooling fans assist this process to ensure the coolant temperature drops effectively. Cycle. The cooled down coolant then cycles back to absorb more heat from the engine. Condenser. The condenser, on the other hand, is part of the air conditioning system. Its role is to release the heat absorbed by the refrigerant in the cabin. Here's how it functions. Refrigerant. The refrigerant absorbs heat from the car's interior as it evaporates. Heat dissipation. The condenser, located at the front of the radiator, releases this heat to the outside air. Condensation. As the refrigerant cools down, it condenses back into a high-pressure liquid. Cycle. This cooler, high-pressure refrigerant then cycles back into the cabin to absorb more heat. Differences in placement and material. While both are heat exchangers, they typically differ in location and material. Placement. The radiator is usually closer to the engine, while the condenser sits in front of the radiator to get maximum airflow. Material. Radiators often use a mix of aluminum and plastic, while condensers are usually made from aluminum due to its efficient heat transfer properties. In summary, both components are integral to your car's performance but operate in separate systems. The radiator cools the engine while the condenser cools the cabin air. Understanding these differences can be helpful when diagnosing cooling issues or maintaining your vehicle.